Okay, let's go. Hello, welcome to Text Math Lesson. Text Math Lesson to play with numbers. Yeah. Today we are going to look at how to solve equations involving exponents. And these are some examples of equations involving exponents. Okay, let's go. Dear viewers, if today is your first time of viewing our lesson, don't forget to tap on the notification button to notify you anytime I load a new lesson. Thank you. May God bless you. Look at the first question given to us. So the first question says, brackets open, 2x plus 1, brackets okay, close, exponent 5, equal to 243. And how do you solve this kind of question when you come across it? It's very simple. The first one is to convert this into a the power form. We need to change this to power form. And this, and the power should be the same as this, 3. I think 3 can do. So we have to have 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. Now we know that 3 times 3 times 3, 5 times will give us 243. So I'm going to bring this one down. Okay, let's go. Which will give us 2x plus 1 exponent 5 equal to 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 3 exponent 5. Good. So if you have something like this, we know that in indices, where exponents are the same, okay. right? To do with the base. Now, here we realize that the exponents here are the same. So I'm going to say that a exponent n equal to b exponent n here is equal to or implies a equals to b. So what's happening? We have taken the out words, the n's. So here I'll take out the exponent which is 5 5. Then drop the equation by the equation bar. I'm going to have 2x plus 1 equals to we are looking for the value of x. So here I'm going to group items. To group items here, I need to move this one to this side. By doing that, I'm going to subtract both sides with one. Okay, so I'm gonna have 2x plus 1 equal minus 1 equal to 3 minus 1. So we realize that these ones will take out this. So we'll give us 0. Okay? 1 minus 1 is 0. So we are level to here. We are having here okay. 2x equal to 3 minus 1 is 2. So now I'm going to divide both sides by 2 to make x stand on its own. We divide both sides by 2. So 2x divided by 2 divided by 2. So our x now equals to 1. Okay, let's so the go. value of x here is 1. Good. Now let's take the second example. And these are the second example. So let's solve this. Now, I need to change this to the power form. Or to the index form. So to write this in the index form, here I'll use 2. Okay, let's go. Okay, so we are going to use 2 for the 32. So in the index form, I'm going to have 2 times 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. Okay. Then, there's okay. 243. And the same thing here, I'm going to do 3 times 3 times 3 times 3 times 3. Good. Now, let's not begin now. So for now, I'm going to drop the equation back again. So I'm going to have x go. minus 1, x to 5, equal to, I'm not going to write 32 out of 243. No, I'm going to write this. So the 32 gives us 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 2 exponent 5 out of 3 exponents again 5. So we have this. Now I need to factor out this because 5 is common. So the common factor here is 5. We need to factor out this. So we are going to have this to be 
x minus 1 exponent 5 equal to okay let's go so here i'm going to write 2 out of 3 equal to exponent 5 so we have found out 5 here so here i'm going to do away with the 5 before the exponents are the same so we do away with the exponent so now we are left with here we are left with x minus 1 equal to 2 out of 3 beautiful so this is what we have now to solve this because we are looking for x now okay, to solve this we are going to multiply through by the denominator 3 to do away with the 3 here because we want linear equation so to get a linear equation now you multiply 3 by x here you have 3x minus 3 times sorry 1 times 3 or okay. 3 times 1 will give us 3 equal to 2 out of 3 times 3 will give us 2 when you multiply 3 by this fraction you get 2 right so the next step here is to group like this again remember we did something here so if i want to move this to the right hand side this one is negative so i need to kill this one by adding 3 to both sides so that this one will go out so here i'm going to have 3x minus 3 plus 3 equal to 2 okay, plus 3 very good so now this will take out this so now we are left with 3x is equal to 5 now because we want x now you divide both sides by 3 3 okay let's go so this one take out this so what are we done with here with this we are left with x is equal to 5 out of 3 simple simple thank you very much this brings us to the end of our lesson don't forget to like to share and comment try this one for me then after doing that you send your results to my comment section thank you see you again in my next lesson bye bye